In this video, I'm going to explain the many ways that you have to format your charts in Empower. I've already prepared a stacked column chart to show you the possibilities of formatting. By clicking on my chart, the action bar appears right above it. Generally speaking, there are two ways of how I can format my chart. For example, concerning the coloring. Firstly, I could go to the series menu and work right here. Or I could work directly in my chart. By clicking on one element, the column of this data point is selected. If I click once again, the whole series of data points is selected. And I can work with the overlay menu and format this series or only this element. I can change the setting in the help section of the empower ribbon. By simply clicking on the charts user settings, I can define what should be selected at the first click on a data point in a chart. So right now I've selected points first and if I select series first and click once, the series is selected first and if I click then once again, only the data point is selected. In the overlay menu, I have the possibility to change the fill color of the selected columns in this case. Right now I've only selected one column and I can change the fill color like that. Moreover, I can change the pattern of my filling right here and I can define the border style of my column. Right now I've selected no border but it, but I could also go with for example a dark blue. Right here I can select the dash style and the weight of my border and this is what it looks like right now. And by clicking on reset my border disappears once again. Now let's have a closer look on the series menu. Right here I can change the fill color of the whole series. So I could change it for example to a lighter color right here. Moreover I have the possibility to define if the fill color should be different if my values are negative. So as you can see in series 1 I have one negative value and I could for example highlight negative values and make them more striking in red. By clicking on the X, this setting is undone. Furthermore, Empower offers the possibility to configure your data chart so that the colors will be adopted from Excel. This function works if you have an Excel file linked to your chart and also when you only work with a mini Excel. So if you switch on the option Use Excel Color, Empower uses the colors of your corporate design color palette of the current customizing that are the closest to the colors used in the respective Excel. As you can see, this is the Excel file that is linked to my chart. Right here I've used a conditional formatting that colors my values. And if I now use the function of use Excel colors, I will have to refresh my Excel link. And as you can see, now the colors of the Excel file are used in my chart. And you might have noticed that it is not the exact same green as in Excel, but the green of my corporate design color palette is used right here. So I hope this video gave you a quick insight on how you can format your charts in Empower. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.